Most definitely. Uh, I felt like down, uh, down the stretch of the game from the start, really, uh, the defensive side was was won us the game today. Uh, the defense led to offense, and we knew that going in before the game. Uh, we knew also that they were going to hard hard show, and we were ready for, I feel like, our approach before the game, and I feel like we really executed. They had cut it to six a little over five minutes to go, and then you guys just exploded on it for like a 12-4 run. What, what got that going? How, did, how were you able to flow it though? Uh, just staying in the moment. We knew they were going to go on runs. We knew we were going to go on runs. And uh, I think the thing is, when they go on runs, just being able to stay calm, stay together, stay in the moment, and uh, make basketball plays and believe in one another. Did a lot of this run that's going on for your team collectively start with Michigan State and just kind of carry over to see That's a good question. Uh, in all honesty, I'm going to say it started this summer. Uh, okay. When our, our freshmen came in, I felt like it, I felt like we were going to be really good. I, I believed it. I felt like the freshmen that came in believed it, and everybody else that were on the team, from the coaching staff, from to the players to the managers, really felt like we were going to be good this year, and we all believed it. So each and every day that we, we get to practice, you know, that's a blessing. So I feel like we don't really take that for granted, and I don't want us to take it for granted. And each and every day, I, I want us to approach it the same way. I asked TJ, this looked like defense for the game tonight. You know, it was, uh, you know, they, they scored a bit around the rim, but we, I thought we defended the three-point line really, really well, and we, we created some turnovers, uh, which which got us into transition. So from that standpoint, yes, uh, you know, they, they did get, get the ball in and around the rim a little bit too much for my liking, but uh, we, we played enough uh, gritty man-to-man -to, -man to get get the job done today. Bolton really struggled in the first half to the three, but I thought the game turned around. They were kind of cutting it back, and he yeah. hit that three from the top of the key to no that. question. And both he and Sean, I think, uh, made some big threes for us during that spurt, and we need those guys to step up and make shots. They had great looks in the first half, um, but they're confident shooters. They're good shooters, and, uh, you know, TJ believes in them, and, and they kept distributing the ball, which was nice to see. And, uh, we're a lot better when sharing the ball and stepping into shots and making shots. We felt like it was a matter of time. First half we didn't make them, second half we were able to knock down a few. And free throw shooting, is that something this team really yeah, it's, it's We're working on it. Uh, you know, It's been really good for us when we've needed it, and it's been just okay when we've, we've had games when it hasn't. But, uh, you know, it's something that we can improve upon, certainly. But today we, we, we needed every bit of our, well, our free throws to win this game. 4-0 start. I don't know what Wilmington did tonight. I know Charles is already run, so, you know, just... Yeah, I mean, it's, today it's game by game. It's a, it's a long season. It's an 18-game uh, seeding tournament for the CAA tournament. And, uh, you know, to be out 4-0, we're, we're grateful. We're, you know, we've got a long way to go and a lot more to, 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 uh, to compete, compete for. Okay. I don't want to repeat any questions that already got asked, but, you know, didn't shoot the ball. Great tonight, nice still able to come out with a win. What does that kind of say about your team? Yeah, and I said to our guys, you know, every game's not going to be like it was against Delaware on Thursday night where the ball's just going in. Uh, I thought we had really good looks in the first half. They just didn't go. And, um, you, you know, I think good shooters know that. You're staying with them. If you miss three and you're a 50% shooter, that means the next three are going in. And you got to continue to shoot with confidence. And, and we got to continue to share the basketball. And I thought we did that in the second half. Going with that smaller lineup a lot with Alex at the five, yeah. is that something you really like going forward? Well, I mean, it's, uh, Anthony has has played really well for us and, and I think had an impact on tonight's game. But Max gives us a different look as well. And there was a lot of ball screen motion for them. They were driving lanes. And he's a, he's a gritty rebounder too. So we don't lose that much on the glass, but we gain a little bit more perimeter defensively uh, when Max is in the game. But both those guys are going to have to play big for us this year.